Hello students, in previous video we have started the exercise of lesson number 10 and we have already discussed A and B part of this. So today we will start with the C part that is tick the correct option. First is a disease that may, may be caused by drinking polluted water is. So, which disease is caused by drinking polluted water? Malaria, cough, cholera and dengue. So, cholera is caused by drinking polluted water. Next is, polluted water should not be used for irrigation because. So, we know that we have discussed that polluted water should not be used for irrigation. So, what is the reason behind it? Because it can harm aquatic animals. It pollutes river water, it reduces fertility of soil, it increases the production of crops. So we know that if we use polluted water for irrigation, it does not harm any aquatic animals, so this statement is false. It pollutes river water, so this is again false statement. It reduces the fertility of soil, yes, it can reduce the fertility of soil. And the last one is, it increases the production of crops. So, no, if the fertility of uh, soil uh, will reduce, the production will not increase. The crop may get damaged. So, this is the correct option. It reduces the fertility of soil. Next is, oil spills in the sea are harmful because disease and uh, decrease the level of water in sea in fact the aquatic plants increase the growth of microorganisms in water or cut off the supply of oxygen for aquatic animals so you know that uh, oil spills in the sea uh, are harmful because oil makes a layer on water और वो कवर कर देता है वाटर को एक लेयर बना के एंड फर्स्ट ऑप्शन इज डिक्रीज द लेवल ऑफ वाटर इन सी सो नो इट डज नॉट डिक्रीज द लेवल ऑफ वाटर इनफैक्ट द एक्वेटिक प्लांट्स सो एक्वेटिक प्लांट्स को ये इफेक्ट इसलिए नहीं करता क्योंकि वो ऊपर एक लेयर बनाता है वो वाटर के अंदर नहीं जाता है ऑयल वो सिर्फ वाटर के ऊपर ही लेयर बना देता है एक कवर बना देता है Increase the growth of microorganism in water, so it does not increase the growth of microorganism. वो industrial and agricultural waste जो होते हैं, वो microorganisms की growth को increase करते हैं, not the oil spills. And last is cut off the supply of oxygen for aquatic animals. तो yes, जो layer form होती है water के ऊपर oil की, वो oxygen की supply को cut off कर देती है. जो जिसकी वजह से एक्वेटिक एनिमल्स को ऑक्सीजन नहीं मिल पाता सो दिस इज द करेक्ट ऑप्शन एंड द लास्ट वन इज पॉल्यूशन ऑफ रिवर वाटर कैन बी रिड्यूस्ड इफ सो हम रिवर वाटर के पॉल्यूशन को कैसे रिड्यूस कर सकते हैं केमिकल फर्टिलाइजर्स आर यूज्ड फॉर इंक्रीज प्रोडक्शन ऑफ क्रॉप्स सो वी हैव डिस्कस दैट जो केमिकल फर्टिलाइजर्स हैं इट गेट डिसॉल्व इन रेन वाटर and flows into the rivers or other water bodies so it uh, does not reduce the water pollution it causes the water pollution so this is false well, farmers use sprinkler for irrigating the fields so by using sprinklers they can reduce the wastage of water usse uh, pollution river ka reduce nahi hoga balki wastage of water reduce ho jayegi right Third is water is allowed to stagnate around the river bank. So अगर river के bank में water stagnant होगा, so उससे water pollution जो river pollution है, वो reduce नहीं हो सकता। और जो stagnant water है, उसमें mosquitoes breed करेंगे, और उससे और ज़्यादा जो है diseases फैलेगी, because stagnant water जो है वो ब्रीडिंग प्लेस है मॉस्किटोज के लिए दैट वी हैव लर्न एंड लास्ट वन इज पीपल डू नॉट वॉश क्लोथ्स एंड और बाथ देयर कैटल्स इन रिवर सो यस 
if people do not wash clothes or bath their cattle in river then it can reduce the pollution of river water so uh, this is the correct option now d part uh, answer the following questions in brief so let us discuss the questions of d part first is name any two materials which can make river water impure so d part name any two materials any two materials which can which can make rain water impure so you know that when rain water just form it is the purest form of water jab rain water form hota hai to wo kaisa hota hai purest form hota hai sabse pure hota hai but jab wo niche aata hai so on the way it get mixed with many things jo usko impure banata hai so you have to name any two materials which can make rain water impure so aise two cheeze hum kya aap koi bhi two cheeze likh sakte hain like dust and smoke particles smoke particles you can also write uh, germs so dust and smoke particles can make can make rain water impure so ye aapko uh, kya hai impure bana deta hai rain water ko next question is name any two name any two human activities human activities which can cause which can cause water pollution so we have uh, learned many human activities which can cause water pollution so we have to write here only two human activities so you can write any two the two human activities the two human activities which can cause which can cause water pollution r so we have to write any two so i will write people wash people wash their clothes clothes and bath in river water right and second is uh, people throw domestic waste in river so these are the two human activities which can cause water pollution and you can write any two maine yahan par two likhi hai aap koi bhi aur two bhi likh sakte hain it is not necessary that uh, you have to write these two only because many human activities which can cause water pollution are mentioned in your book so you can write any two human activity now uh, try to find out the answers of the remaining questions that is third fourth and fifth and also try to find out the answers of e part 
uh, five questions of E part. So in next video we will discuss them. Thank you.